Welcome everyone. Today I will be offering you a combination of meditation, uh, movement and breath, some pranayama work. This class is geared to help you come back into your body, drop back in out of the mind in this time of chaos and stress. We'll start with a gentle meditation, coming into the body, noticing awareness and finding some pranayama. And then from there, we'll move into some gentle movements to help you ground. And then we'll come back to meditation at the end and do a meta meditation together. So feel free to find a safe space within your home, free of obstruction and hopefully some distraction. Find a comfortable seated position. And if you would like to come with me, you can start with the left shin in front of the right shin. And that is just an intention setting of perceiving before we take action. And as you settle into your seat, if you have a block at home, sometimes it can be nice to sit on a block or a pillow just to find a little bit of lift, especially if your hips are tight. So as we find this comfortable seat, if you'd like to stick with the grounding sensation, perhaps keep your palms down. If you need a little bit of uplifting energy and you wanna turn your palms up, you can find that. Or perhaps today is one of those days where nothing makes sense because you all have those. One palm can be up and one palm can be down. And as you settle into your simple cross-legged position, allow the eyes to gently close. Just taking an initial few moments to allow the body to arrive into the space and the shape that you created for yourself. start with a few grounding breaths together finding a big inhale through the nose open the mouth exhale two more like that really big breath in through the nose fill into the low belly open mouth exhale and then one more time deep breath in through the nose Open the mouth, exhale. Releasing the deep breath, coming into neutral breath in and out of the nostrils. Observing how the breath moves in and out of the body. Observing perhaps any constriction within the body with the breath. Perhaps even tapping into ujjayi breath, if that serves you. Gently constricting the muscles at the back of the throat. Listening to the wave of the breath as it enters and releases. Taking a moment to relax into the physical body. Bringing your awareness to the right leg, from the right hip all the way down to the right toes. Relaxing, releasing the leg down to the earth. Moving the awareness to the left leg, from the left hip all the way down to the left toes. Releasing, relaxing the leg down to the earth. Bringing your awareness to the entire pelvis, the hips. Letting the hips soften, allowing the sitting bones to release down into the block, the pillow, the support, the mat. Allowing the torso to relax, the entire length of the spine. Softening back body, side body front body. Bring awareness to the right arm from the right shoulder all the way down to right fingertips. Softening, relaxing the entire arm. Mm -hmm. 
left arm from left shoulder down to left fingertips. Relaxing, softening the entire left arm. Bringing the awareness to the neck, the throat. Softening, relaxing into the tops of shoulders. Noticing the head, the skull, back of the head, top of the head, relaxing, softening. Allowing the jaw to release. The cheeks softening space around the eyes and between the eyes relax and release the brow the third eye softening the entire body relaxed still almost as if you're a breathing statue Keeping everything nice and soft, coming back to the breath. Allowing it to be gentle and passive. Following the breath as it enters in through the nose and releases out of the nose. Staying in this place of gentleness and softness, we'll practice some pranayama together and four count box breath. And what we'll do is we'll inhale for a count of four, hold at the top of the breath for that count of four, release the exhale at a count of four, and hold at the bottom of the breath count of four. So first together finding a big inhale through the nose and a deep exhale out of the nose. And working towards allowing the inhale and the exhale to be equal length. the softness in the body, awareness on the breath. Finding an inhale together and exhale. Beginning the breath, inhale for two, three, four, hold, two, three, Four, exhale, two, three, four, hold, two, three, four, inhale, two, three, four, hold, two, three, four, exhale, two, three, four, hold, two, three, Four. Inhale. Hold. Exhale. Hold. Inhale. Hold. Exhale. Hold, inhale, hold, exhale, hold, inhale, hold, 
exhale, hold, inhale, hold, exhale, hold. Returning back to your normal natural breath. Gentle inhales and exhales out of the nose. Continuing to stay soft, gentle, passive, yet aware. Resting within the stillness. Allowing the breath to be your anchor into this moment. As you're ready, slowly find your way back into the present moment, beginning to mindfully invite some small movement into the body, deepening the breath and allowing that to be the vehicle to bring you out of our meditative seat. And as you're ready, moving really slowly, taking this mindfulness with you, we'll meet in a child's pose. Allowing the knees to be wide, sending the heart down to the earth, reaching forearms long. Surrender the crown, surrender forehead down to the mouth. Next breath in, let's rise, tabletop position. Take a moment to settle into all fours, wrists beneath the shoulders, knees beneath the hips. And we'll just do a little bit of gentle cat-cow, but see if you can keep the movement slow and mindful so we can stay in this meditative state. On your inhale, drop the belly down. Baby bend in the elbows, draw the heart through, gaze up. Exhale, round and release, draw the chin to the chest. And just find that motion at your own pace. Every inhale, belly drops down, heart lifts, gaze lifts. Exhale, round, release, press into the earth, make space in the back body. And just continue like this at your own breath. Every inhale, belly drops down. Every exhale, press and round. Invitation to keep your eyes closed as you find these initial movements through the spine. And just notice some areas that may be a little bit tighter today. How can you breathe to create more space, to find range of motion? Invitation to stay here, or if you want, curl your toes, draw big circles in the hips, just to start to wake up into the hip joints especially after our seat. Reverse your circle as you're ready. And then whenever you're ready, there's no rush whatsoever. We'll curl our toes and find a downward facing bone. Feel free to invite in some movement here, some pedaling out through the feet. Bending through the knees, a little rocking out side to side through the waist. Shaking the head, baby yes, baby no. Planting down through all ten fingertips, feel the shoulders begin to kick on. Settling in some stillness whenever you're ready. Pressing down into all ten fingertips, find the leg through the arms. Draw the belly into the spine to assist the lift in the hips. Perhaps you can gently press your thighs back and start to release your heels down to the earth. 
Big inhale through the nose. Open mouth, exhale. Two more, just like that. Breathe in through the nose. Open mouth, exhale. One more time, breathe in through the nose. Open mouth, exhale. Feel free to find your way through tabletop or gaze forward. Step your left foot in between your hands. Drop the right knee down to the earth. Fingertips can frame your front foot or feel free to bring your hands to your front thigh. Sink in, open up front right hip. Closing the eyes, breathing here. For more stability, keep your back toes curled. Otherwise, feel free to release top of foot down to the earth. And for those of us that want a little bit extra through the heart, you can grab opposite elbows behind the back. For a little bit deeper, feel free to interlace fingers, press the heels, the hands together. Draw the heart up into the sky. Continue drawing the belly into the spine gently to support into the low back. Can you drop back into that meditative state that we began with? A place of gentleness, awareness, softening. Find an inhale here, and then as you exhale, half Hanuman, sit your hips back towards your back heel. Flex your left foot, spread your left toes. As you energetically draw your left hip back, Start to release the belly and the chest down towards that left leg. Close the eyes, find your breath. Big breath in, deep breath out. Inhale, come back into your lunge. Curl your right toes. Walk around to the right side of your mat, parallel off your feet, wide-legged forward bend, inhale to halfway rise, exhale to surrender down. Plant the palms on the floor onto your mat and then start to walk them underneath of the hips to release the heart down, release the crown down. Draw the shoulders up and away from your ears. Gentle engagement through the legs to support into the release. Relax the spine, relax the head. Close your eyes, find your breath. Next inhale, lift halfway. Exhale, walk around to frame your right foot. Drop left knee down, low lunge. Fingertips can frame front foot, otherwise hands come to front thigh. Back toes can stay curled for support, otherwise untuck and release hips. Perhaps you hang here, just lengthening out left thigh, left psoas, or grab opposite elbows, opposite forearms behind the back. Or perhaps interlace opposite them on top, whatever feels a little weird, open up the chest. Big inhale, half Hanuman, exhale. Energetically draw right hip back, flex right foot strong, spread right toes. Big breath in, deep breath out. Inhale, come back into your lunge. Curl your left toes, pick up back knee, walk around, wide-legged forward bend one more time. This time, if you choose, peace fingers, big toe, or grab onto ankles, shins, calves. Inhale to halfway rise, exhale to sink back in. Big breath in. And deep breath in. Plant fingertips, inhale, halfway lift. Walk around, frame your left foot, reset down, we're facing them. Deep breath in. 
and a big breath out. On your inhale, shift forward to a plank pose. Let's lower all the way down. Take a back bend before some final stretching for our last meditation. Sphinx pose as you're ready. Make sure that the wrists are beneath, or the um, elbows are beneath the shoulders. The wrists and forearms are parallel. Flare through your fingertips. Press down to the tops of feet. Lift the heart through. Energetically start to draw the elbows back in towards the belly. The shoulders draw along the spine. Find that brightness and brawness across the collarbones and the chest. Close the eyes. And for a moment, bring the awareness to the heart space. Find a big breath in. Exhale, slow release. Press through your tabletop, inhale, child's pose. Exhale, perhaps this time bring the knees towards one another as you surrender down. Mm. Inhale, slow rise, sit off to one side. And we're gonna do a little grounding meditative flow before our final meditation. So from here, we'll start in a cross-legged position with your left shin in front of your right shin. And this will be a constant movement meditation, um, very slow, Udra, your breath will help you. If um, a reverse tabletop does not feel good in your body, which we will find it, just plant your palms and press the chest forward versus full reverse tabletop. So just a little variation if you want it. Otherwise, meet me in a comfortable cross-legged, left shin in front of your right shin. From here, we'll do it nice and slow. On your inhale, reach into the sky. As you exhale, gently fold over the legs. On your inhale, roll back up, reach up. Exhale, plant the palms and plant the feet. Inhale, reverse tabletop, rise up. Exhale, release the hips. Take your right shin in front of your left shin. Inhale, reach your arms back into the sky. Exhale, plant the palms on the knees. On your inhale, send your chest forward into the right, circle out. Exhale, send it back into the left. Inhale, circle left and back. Exhale, circle right and forward. Inhale, reach your arms back up, straighten your legs. Exhale, fold. Inhale, reach back up, left shin in front of right. Exhale, hands on tops of the knees. So, We'll do two more on the left side and two more on the right side. It feels really nice to let your hair down and just kind of go with it. So feel free if that feels good. Take your time, slow down if you need to, and just follow my breath, my words, and see if you can even close your eyes and just listen. Inhale, reach into the sky. Exhale, fold over the legs. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, plant hands behind you, plant feet. Inhale, reverse tabletop, lift up. Exhale, right chin in front of the left. Inhale, reach into the sky. Exhale, hands on the knees. Inhale, send your chest forward to the right. Exhale, sink back and left. Good, inhale, reverse your circle. Exhale, complete the circle. Inhale, stretch along, extend your legs long. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, rise up, left shin in front of the right. Exhale, hands on the knees. One more time this side. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, fold over the legs. Inhale, rise, reach up. Exhale, plant hands behind you, plant feet. Reverse table, inhale. Exhale, right shin in front of the left. Inhale, reach to the sky. Exhale, hands to the knees. Inhale, send your chest forward and to the right. Exhale, back into the left. Reverse circle, inhale. And exhale. Inhale, send your arms long, legs long. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, rise up, left shin in front of the right. Exhale, hands and the knees. Take a big breath here. Exhale, relax it out. Plant the palms, gently switch your shins right in front of left. We'll do it three times this side. 
Take a moment to settle back into your seat. And here we go. Inhale, reach your arms up. Exhale, fold over the legs. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, plant hands, plant feet. Inhale, rise, press hips up. Exhale, left shoulder in front of the right. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, hands to the knees. This time, inhale, chest forward to the left. Exhale, back to the right. Reverse circle, inhale. And exhale. Inhale, reach up, legs long. Exhale, fold and release. Inhale, rise up, right shoulder in front of the left. Exhale, return to your seat. Again, inhale, reach tall. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, rise up. Exhale, plant hands, plant feet. Inhale, press up. Exhale, left shoulder in front of right. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, hands to the knees. Inhale, circle left. Exhale, circle right. Reverse circle, inhale. And exhale. Inhale, reach up, legs long. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, rise up, right shoulder in front of the left. Exhale, hands to the knees. Last time, follow the breath. Inhale, rise up. Fold forward, exhale. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, plant hands, plant feet. Inhale, press hips high. Exhale, left shoulder in front of the right. Inhale, reach up tall. Exhale, hands to the knees. Inhale, circle left. Exhale, circle right. Inhale, circle right. Exhale, circle left. Legs straight, inhale, rise up. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, reach to the sky. Right shoulder from the left, exhale, relax it down. Take a full breath in. And a full breath out. We'll settle in for one more meditation. So if there is a final stretch that you'd like to do before you do that, feel free. Otherwise, meet me back in your seat. And this time we'll keep the right shin in front of the left shin. Now that we have perceived taking action, allowing the masculine side to come into play. Taking that moment whenever you're ready to be back in your seat. Gently closing the eye. Following the breath as it enters in and out of the nose. Softening into the body. Allowing yourself to come back to that breathing statue. to come to a meta meditation. I'm going to do it a little bit differently today. Considering our current situation, I thought that we could add on and just let it become our own. So in our meta meditation, it's all about receiving and sending out that loving kindness. May I be safe. May I be healthy, may I be happy, and may I live at ease. So first and foremost, we'll start small and then get a little bit bigger with how we send out our meditation and our loving kindness. So first, let's begin with ourselves. Repeating to yourself quietly within the mind. May I be safe. May I be healthy. May I be happy. May I live at ease. Allowing yourself to sit in that vibration of loving kindness. Next, we'll 
send it out to someone that we have a profound amount of love for. This can be a person or even a pet. Repeating to yourself within the mind, may they be safe. May they be healthy. May they be happy. May they live at ease. Allowing yourself to take a moment to sit with that vibration of loving kindness that you send out to the person that you love. Next, we'll send some love and kindness to someone that challenges us. This can still be someone very close to you. Seeing that individual in our mind's eye and repeating to ourselves, may they be safe. May they be healthy. May they be happy. May they live at ease. Allowing yourself to sit in that vibration as you send that love and kindness to that individual that challenges you. Now thinking about your community that you're closest in, maybe that's your work environment, your home life, your yoga community, your workout community, whatever you tend to, the people that you surround yourself with the most. Seeing what that group may look like may manifest for you. And repeating these words to yourself. May they be happy. May they be safe. May they be healthy. May they live at ease. Sitting within that vibration and sending that love and kindness out to your community. And last but not least, as we are all in this together, sending love and kindness out to the entire world, seeing the earth, may we be safe. May we be healthy. May we be happy. May we live at ease. Allow yourself to sit in this vibration, this vibration of loving kindness. coming back to your breath, coming back to this body, this moment. Softening, releasing, relaxing. And as we bring this practice to a close, I invite you to take this mindfulness, this loving kindness that you have brought into this space, brought into this body in this moment, take that with you into your day, into your evening. 
and allow yourself to come back to the space whenever you need that gentle reminder to stay within the body, stay within the breath. And take it one moment at a time. And as you're ready, slowly start to find some small movements in the body. When you're ready, meet me with prayer hands. Thumbs against the breastbone, Anjali Mudra, gently bowing the chin to the chest, taking this moment to thank yourself for arriving to your mat. Thank yourself for this body, for this moment, for this breath. May every breath that we take and every move that we make be on our mat benefit the greater good. And may we always hold unconditional love for all living beings, but especially holding that love for ourselves. Gently floating the prayer to your third eye, the light in me sees and honors the light in you. Namaste. Mm, thank you so much for practicing with me.